If you want to learn how to 3D model but don't know how to use a set of calipers, then in the next 90 seconds, I'm going to show you exactly how to use them. There are three main methods to measure an item. You have the main teeth of the caliper that measure the outside dimensions of an item. You have the inner teeth that can tell the inside dimensions of an item. Then you have the bottom measurement, which can measure the depth of an item. Reading your calipers is straightforward, but before you measure anything, you have to make sure to clean your calipers, close it, set it to zero, and then you can start measuring the item you want. You measure this cube, you can see that we get a little over 80 millimeters. By also selecting this function, you can see we also get inches and fractions. The inside teeth also function the same for measuring the inside of this tray, which gives us this reading here. But what if we wanted to measure the height of the tray? So we will use the depth measure to find the distance, which is this bottom section here. There is one additional way to measure an item using this step gauge. We essentially lay whatever it is we wanna measure on the back, and if we were to double check using the main teeth, you can see we get the same measurements and they're pretty much spot 